Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm in the Valley of the Four Winds right now in the Mist of Pandaria Beta. And I'm going to be doing the quest around here right now. And the first one that's introduced to you is by Chen Stormstout. Chen and Lee, my niece and I are new to Pandaria. Probably like yourself. Oh, that sounded weird. I was like, wait. <laughs> we're visitors from the Wandering Isle. And to be honest, we have no idea where we're going. That farm up ahead looks like as fine a place as any to take off our shoes and enjoy a brew. What would you say, Lily? Orc, would you like to share the road with us? Follow Chin Storms out to Pangstead. Sounds simple enough. Whoa. Chen is impatient. You just like onward. I am called Chen. This is my niece. That's kind of cool that, uh, he's from the Wandering Isle. He's not actually from Pandaria. <laughs> he doesn't like beer? Strange lad indeed. Welcome, welcome. Have you come to sample some of my son's turnips? We'll have to purchase a few pigs. I can purchase a pig, oh my god. Slay the vermin. Oh, look at him lumbering about. Unearth seven pieces of farm equipment. Whoa, whoa. That sounds a little too loud for this. These vermin are too excited. Yeah. Death siphon hitting for about a flat 30k now. Whoa. I'm flying. Is Sunsoak Meadow also a DC zone? Yeah, I was exploring around here. I, you guys won't see me actually get much exploration uh, experience because I was looking. I didn't do any quests or anything. I just kind of looked around. I was trying to find some interesting stuff. Didn't really work. Did find one area though that leads to the uh, Veil of Eternal Blossoms, I think it's called. And you weren't. I think, at least, you weren't supposed to get up there by means of this area because it was hard for me, like, I had to really, really, really try to get up there. You defiled your own lands, you know the file mine. Oh, my ghoul died. Hey, you vermin scout, there's someone I'd like to introduce you to. He really likes. Oh, you're mine. He really likes candles. What would happen if these guys and the uh, kobolds got together? There'd be just like a carrot slash roasted barley tea. Cool. Oh, I already got them. No, I don't want to kill you. Just want to loot you. There'd be a carrot slash candle shortage everywhere. Ooh, that's tools. Go get him. Kind of like how if you use that too, uh, it'll help me get chill lanes and everything around me. Oh jeez, I'm actually losing health here. They're hitting me pretty hard. But then again, I'm pulling more than I should. Okay, never mind, they're hitting pretty hard. It's 
pretty simple though. First, first thing you need to do is clear out some of the vermin so that we can help farm. Grab some farm stuff. One gold bandage. Yep. Six thousand eight hundred forty every second. Not bad. Five of seven buried components. So two more of these, and I'll be all set. Oh, cool! I don't. I like how a lot of the stuff in Pandaria too is you don't have to dismount to do it. Because so many times in Cataclysm, it was like you have to dismount just to click something. It's helping out a hosen farmer. Seemingly endless nuisance. Are these better? Oh wow. Those are actually better for me, but I don't want to get rid of my force yet. So that's cool. <laughs> They're not all gone, but you helped. Find Aang Thunderfoot. Oh, there's one more. Are you looking for the owner of this place? Then look to the Pandaren at the top of the stairs. I'm a visitor just like you. Listen to Zhao and his companions. So, do any of you know where the Hidden Master lives? How about now? I'm pretty sure that's why he's called the Hidden Master, Lin. Oh, sorry. Oh, how about now? Wasn't even in this. So, where do we sh should we search first? I can try asking in the streams for guidance. Jinyu, ask the streams. You're no Elder Ashio. You're not even a Jinyu grown yet. It would be a waste of your time. Ken Ken thinks we should split up. Follow our four winds. Follow the four winds. That's a much better idea, Ken Ken. I volunteer to travel south into the jungle. Can we go yet? Are you done with your beer? Ah, oh, that's Lily. I will follow the road north. Ken Ken, go chase east wind. Shortest walk. I, I suppose I'll go west then. Very well, as the oldest and fattest among us, I will wait here for each of you. <laughs> That's awesome. Like how he also says that you don't have to follow him. Now you follow up on each of them. Hold on. Sorry about that, got a phone call and had to take it. Turtles, me versus you. Let's do this. Leroy! The, there's a quest later in this area that I've been hearing about as I was running around. And it involves, like, talking or... No, not talking. Killing some turtles. And, yeah. Obtain some stolen fruit. And they're just, like, ridiculously buggy right now. They DC you over and over. It takes you, like, 50 DCs to kill, like, 10 of them. Ooh, six pump. Okay. Oh, cool. Oh! <laughs> this is a weird quest. I don't know what I'm doing. Just... Just... I went off this morning to watch my papa, papa fight the vermin. When I came back, the farm was full of marmots. I don't want to kill them, but we need to get rid of them. Hey, I know, we can close the holes. Fill their holes with dirt, so they can't come out in our farm anymore. Whoa, what? I don't want to kill him. He just said not to kill them, and then... Oh, ghoul, you're so stupid. One more. Oop, oop, oop. kinda cool. I think I can continue filling these in though, because I think one spawned and just my ghoul killed it. But one spawned from doing this. And for whatever reason my ghoul was like, nope, you're gonna die. Oh, 
I know that there's only like two working spawns right now. So I guess it's worth it to just fill in holes until then. Oh, that's a working spawn. That's that. <laughs> that's so cute. Oh no! I got you! There we go. We got three. Oh, the warlock's gonna get it. Oh, oh, oh. I got it! Yeah! Come on, anymore? Bring it on, marmots. Bring it on. Take you all on. Fill in all your holes. Oh no! Oh, well, that one respawned. That means the one over here is going to respawn. Got this. I got this. Call dibs. I will not let this night elf defeat me. I will not let the alliance show me up. Oh, there it is! I got it! I get it! Kick! That's kind of a cool quest. Thank you, now I can get back to my chores. You're welcome. Stool and turn up. Stool and watermelon. Taking a crop. Alright, fine, I don't have everything under control. I spent all morning fighting them off my property and I got away with some of my crops. Whoa! Yep! <laughs> Fight all the vermin! Oh god, I'm dying. Help me fight already! Uh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die! Oh no. Oh, I overpulled. I vastly underestimate the power of a leveling Death Knight. At least in Pandaria, since stuff has changed. <sighs> Don't tell me I'm gonna be like in Jade Forest or something when I die. Come on. Just load me into like... somewhere. Really close. Like, right there. Just res me instantly. Oh, cool. Yep, right near it. That guy was, uh doing the meditation quest in, uh, Jade Forest. <laughs> People aren't as patient as they were yesterday. Oh, hey, Oddbit's back on. And then... over here, there must be another hole or something. And that's where I'll get the watermelon. Because then in there is where I get the turnips. I figured everything out. <laughs> yeah, that is kind of how that quest made people feel. And now they're all dead. At least I can steal all the loot. What's with the- what the- We murder every turnip. What? What? This is- Dear God, that's terrifying. Oh boy. Oh boy. 
That was one of the most terrifying things I've seen in this game. Rooted. Oh, cool. Give me my health back. Oh, finally, something that actually has wind wool cloth on it. I haven't gotten any wind wool cloth in forever. Okay, now where are my stolen watermelons? Turnips, why are you so bad? Wait, so they stole the turnips, but they don't even enjoy them? Can I? Can I? Can I just like come over and be like, hello? Do they even enjoy watermelon? Or are they gonna start yelling again in that really creepy way? Because I really hope I never see that again. There we go. And Path of Frost for the win. Nice. All done with the extremely creepy quest. Whew. I could have nightmares about that vermin doing that. Just like a room full of them all yelling. They shall murder your turnips! Perfect. <laughs> what were they doing? Oh, I'm under attack. Man, I want to get a piece of gear that isn't on my, um, tier set. Like, I think that's the shoulders. That's it. And even then, the piece I got before that blue piece wasn't technically better, so I couldn't equip it. So. Practically perfect produce. Do I smell turnips? Oh, 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 oh. Now that's what I like to see. Most of the vegetables were we sold, but we like to keep some for the family. Specifically, my nephew Lang needs to feed his pigs. Unfortunately, the pathway to Lang's farm is currently swimming with vermin. We're going to have to ask Miss Fanny to help us out. Ooh, what is Miss Fanny? Bring some food we've gathered to Miss Fanny, who stands next to my house, and ask her nicely to send them down to Lang's Reach. Bring Aang's giant pink turnip, Aang's summer watermelon, and Pang's extra spicy tofu. Oh god, this is a weird quest. Oh. Oh, she comes to me? So... Miss... Oh... Miss Fanny's not an NPC. She's a giant dinosaur. Um... Where's Peng's farm? Um... Well, it's a turn up. It's a turn up, so... Average power. Did it make it? Oh yeah. Oh, watermelon, it's bigger. Hard as possible because it weighs more. Very softly. <laughs> oh, switch it around. Hit this very hard. And you hit this very soft. Those will explode. Those will not. Hit it very softly. Whoa, that looks like it got overshot. Or not. Hard as possible. Oh yeah. 
What an odd quest. Wow, this really is ridden with vermin. Except there is a conveniently placed path where there are none patrolling. Oh my god. Look at the pigs. Look at the piggy. Kind of sad that they're... Like, they're really cute from far away. Get close and they're kind of ugly. But oh man. That is a beautiful, beautiful pig. I'm so glad they have these. I understand you're the one who sent the food down. Thank you, the pigs are picky eaters. And, but turnips and watermelons are some of their favorites. So then I guess the tofu's for him. Meat Dolly. I told you earlier my pigs are picky eaters. But they need uh, to eat meat to grow strong. But they don't like mutton. They like don't like yak, and I'm not about <laughs> Yeah, if you feed them pig, that'd be kind of evil. They do, however, eat meat of the Mushan beast, but they're also quite partial to turtle. Both creatures can be found in the abundance to the west. Oh my god, that's a lot of turtle meat. I try to keep an eye on the stock, but every once in a while I'll come over. Some of them sneak away. With all the confusion these vermin are causing, I may have let my guard down for a few moments, and some of my piggies escaped. Look for them! Hmm. I'm gonna call it for now, though, guys. Um, I just really wanted to get the first zone done, the, uh, paint. Pankstead, I think it was? I can't even remember. I was just there. That shows how much I pay attention to the location I'm in compared to the lore or the quest decks. Oh my god. He has... He has one of the birds. Look it, look it. I'm gonna end on this note. Look at that bird. Look at its beauty. Look at how beautiful it is. It is singing all night long. Oh yes. It's singing. I will see you next time.